days. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll take my glasses off again. Well, I'm just going to have all of it. If I can do it from memory. Um, so this poem set in medieval times, you know, when people wore such things as cod pieces and chastity belts. I call this poem The Fairy Wood, and to see if she does, listen carefully. Woods that I compare thee to a wood elf, thine magic enchantment to keep for myself, O low radiant elf sin, young wife man, thou doest please me as only thee can. Into the green woods must I thee follow on the raunchy eve of a lewd morrow, take the neverwood part of mine own. Thing. Away into the woods and let's have a fling. Come hither, wench, for I am ready for thee. Oh, sir, I can't stop thine way, saith she. Let me soose thine lips and breasts with fine ale and plunge my blade into thine fairy grail. Standing naked ere the rising of the moon, perchance it wilt up goeth sometime soon. Doth it now not shineth both bright and clear? And that's only the first quarter to appear. With this field due, I do thee consecrate. I pray thee, please me now, I cannot wait. For oft hast thou pleasured my ample manhood and shown me enchantments in the green wood. The velvet tongue of midnight shall strike twelve, thou shalt come. When I dig, dive, and delve, call out thine soul, whether thy wilt or not. At once thy wrench least, I shoot my own shot. Thy hath well beguiled me with thine beauty. Let me do my job. Oh, no, that's not right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, hang on. Prompt, prompt, where's my prompt? You'll be fine, don't be fine. Thou hath well beguiled me with thine beauty. At least I lose the plot, let me do my duty since my magic wand is now at its prime let's straight to bed tis nearly fairy time durst thou have climbed upon me to joy rate loy summery curves tend upon my state i pray thee what wilt thou do to please me oh no not now i've lost that damn key <laughs> <laughs> You've most got it right. Oh no, thank you. No, it's wonderful. I think girls, by the way. Uh, I like mistakes. It makes me sort of wait. It makes it human. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it means I'm not a robot. No, well, it's, it's I what it's all about the apocalypse arms. We're working with the exactly with the digital, you know, and uh, I think, I, th I think that was Apocalypse Interrupters, actually. <laughs> <laughs> and in weaving, uh, I don't think Sarah's going to make it, but she's a fellow weaver. Um, 